Here are the King Oscar sardines. I already had one. They're really good. It's in like olive oil. They're really oily, but I like how neatly they're packaged in here. And I bought these at Walmart, and the King Oscar was like the most expensive one, but I think it also has like the most in it. But yeah, they had some in uh, mustard that Brian said was good, so I was thinking about trying those. I guess they sell different kinds of these King Oscar ones too, I've seen online. They have like ones in tomato sauce, and they have ones like with jalapenos, but I know a lot of people think that sardines are gross, but it's really not. If you like fish, if you like tuna and stuff like that, it might look weird. It's got the skin and they've got bones in them, I think, but they're so small you don't even really know, so... I just had these Ritz crackers left over. Mmm. These are really good. I think it was like three bucks for this can or something. Uh. But. I was kind of. I want, I've been wanting to try like the oysters and stuff that they have too. Those are, get a little more expensive. So it's like. Mmm. I'll have to have some extra money to blow to try one of those, but pretty good. Another friend introduced me to these Kipper snacks. They're like a herring, herring fillets. It's got like a smoky flavor, smoked. It's really good. I was going to get that, but I was like, I want to try something different. When you work at Walmart and you work in the food aisles, you see like so many different things. And it's like, oh, I've never seen that, or I want to try that. And you start getting hungry for stuff like that you don't even, you haven't even tried. Or... So I have tried sardines before, I think maybe like once. I thought, I remember that they had like the heads intact. I thought they had like the eyes and stuff in them. Maybe some of them do, I don't know. These don't, <clears throat> but uh, I think I remember not really being a fan before, but maybe I was just a wimp. <laughs> but I love these. These are great. I'm not really a picky eater. I was when I was a child, but over time, I've learned to appreciate more foods. But, yeah, anyways, I would suggest trying these. Pretty dang delicious, if you ask me.